Not everyone with a Mac uses an iPhone. And while it may be the best way to experience the Apple ecosystem, it's just not something everyone's interested in. The biggest problem then for Android users with a Mac is that there's no direct plug and play functionality for transferring files between their two main devices. Sure, there's Android file transfer, but I think we can all agree that's a big file of mess. I'd actually recommend you stay away from that app. So how do we transfer a file between a Mac and an Android device? Hey guys, I'm Akshay from bbomb.com and in this video I'll tell you how you can transfer your files between a Mac and an Android device. While there's no direct method to do this short of using Android file transfer, there are a couple of great apps that you can use. So let's get started. If you prefer using wired connections, you should definitely take a look at Handshaker. It's very easy to use. To transfer files using Handshaker, you just need to follow a few steps. Install Handshaker on your Mac, the link will be in the description below. Launch the app and connect your Android device. Handshaker will install an app on your phone. I already have it installed by the way. Once that is done, simply reconnect your Android phone to your Mac and you should be able to see all your files in the Handshaker app. You can easily copy and paste files between the two devices and the speeds are decent enough. While Handshaker is definitely a great app, there are times when you simply don't want to deal with cables. You should check out AirDroid for all your wireless transfer needs. It comes with a web interface as well, so you just need the app on your phone and not on your Mac. On your Android device, launch the AirDroid app. You will see an IP address here. Simply launch a browser on your Mac and navigate to that IP address. You will now be able to transfer files between the Android device and the Mac. You can do a lot more with AirDroid, like view call logs, messages, take screenshots, etc. However, those features are not the point of this video, so I'll leave it to you to explore them all. If AirDroid is not to your liking, there's another great app that can let you transfer files wirelessly. ShareIt is an app that works by creating a Wi-Fi hotspot on your devices and transferring data over it. Launch ShareIt on both your Mac and your Android device. On your Android phone, tap on Send if you want to send files to your Mac or Receive if you want to receive files. Then tap on Connect to PC. Tap on Scan to Connect. Scan the QR code displayed on your Mac and you're ready to start transferring files. If you use ES File Explorer on your Android phone, then you can very easily use FTP to transfer files wirelessly between your Android device and your Mac. On your Mac, launch the terminal and type this command. Hit enter. You will be asked for your password. Enter it here and hit enter again. You have now created an FTP server on your Mac. However, you still need to know the IP address for your Mac before you can connect to the FTP server from your Android phone. Press and hold the option key and click on the Wi-Fi icon in the menu bar. You will see your Mac's IP address there. In ES File Explorer, tap on the hamburger icon and go to FTP under Network. Tap on New and fill in the details for the FTP server you created. You will need to enter the username and password for your Mac's login ID. Tap on OK and you're connected to the FTP server. You can now copy and paste files between your Android device and your Mac. So those were some of the ways you can use to transfer files between your Mac and an Android device. I hope these methods help you use your Android phone with a Mac and if they did, let me know by giving this video a like. Also subscribe to our channel for more cool tech videos like this one. Well that was all from my side and until next time, thanks for watching.